Now for this last part, what would be really good is if we can update our profile and update Airtable Air from within our Adalo app. Okay, so if we want to be able to update our profile information, what we need to do is select this button, this update profile button, and on press, we want to link it to a new screen. We're going to call the screen update profile, and this is going to be a form. Press create screen. Now we have a form um, on a new screen with a few fields. If you select this form, tell it to which data collection. This is going to be for our Makerpad members collection. And we're going to want this form to update the current Makerpad member. And then you can see we have lots of fields in here. Automatically by default, it's going to pull in every single field that you have in your database. And again, that database references your Airtable. So we don't actually want all of these. So click on fields then remove the ones that you don't want the user to be able to update. If you want, you can rename your fields by selecting fields, selecting the field and selecting this. Okay. And for this one, we're just going to put update bio and do the same for these as well. Finally location. Okay. Then if you check your submit button, just check that on the click action, that it's going to update the Makerpad member and then link back to the previous screen. And it's as simple as that. Now let's test if it works. Press preview. You should be logged in now, so you should see a list of members immediately. Select a member. We have a profile, Ben Parker. And what we're going to do, we're going to see if we can update his record to my brother's name, which is Ben Osman. Okay, update profile. This has a pre-filled information now, um, and we actually hadn't added the name field, so I actually took that off. So let's go back and add that. Again, click in, easy as this, click in the form, Click in the fields, and then we're going to add a visible field, which is going to be name. Let's drag this to the top and do the same. Update name. Cool. Again, back into preview. Back into a member. Okay, now update profile, and we should see a name. Let's change this name to Osman. Press update Makerpad member. And we have an updated member profile within Adalo. And if you want to double check that this has worked, head over to your Airtable collection and we'd expect Ben's name to be Ben Osman now. And there we go. If you want to check that it works both ways, go here. Let's change it back to Parker within Airtable. And with a bit of luck, it would have updated our Adalo app. Press preview. And now we're back to Ben Parker. And that's it. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I'm really interested to see how you use this to power your Adalo apps with an Airtable base. If you have any questions on how to implement this, just reach out to me at Tom Osman or inside the Makepad Slack channel. Happy to help and let me know how you get on. Enjoy. Mm -hmm.